Richter syndrome is the transformation of chronic lymphocytic leukemia into an aggressive lymphoma. Complex karyotype is an heterogeneous cytogenetic category from a quantitative and qualitative point of view, associated with a shorter survival in CLL, but its impact on the evolution to a Richter syndrome has not been investigated so far. And among complex karyotype cases, those with at least five chromosome lesion and those with major structural abnormalities, that is type 2 CK, display a more aggressive clinical course. Uh, we perform a retrospective study in Free Italian Referral Center for CLL. And the stimulated cytogenetic was performing 540 patients within the first year after CLL diagnosis. CK was found in 20% of patients at CLL diagnosis, and according to the qualitative classification of CK subtype, 73% were CK2, whereas with regard to the number of chromosome lesion, 49% were classified as high CK. 28, 28 patients developed a Richter syndrome over a median follow-up of seven years. We observed that patients who developed a Richter syndrome were more commonly at the more advanced BNS stage at CLL diagnosis and display a more frequently unfavorable prognostic marker like CK2 and high CK profile as compared to patients who did not develop a Richter syndrome. By univariate and multivariate analysis, the presence of CK overall, CK2, and of high CK were significantly associated with shorter time to Richter syndrome together with uh, uh, mutation immunoglobulin status, TP53 abnormalities, 11Q dilation, and BNA stage. By integrating the statistically significant variables, we developed a hierarchical model based on hazard ratio values. 50% of patients were classified as high CK and or CK2, for whom the 10-year time to Richter syndrome was 31%. 45% of patients were uh, unmutated, immune for immunoglobulin or uh, TP53 abnormalities, 11 q donation, or BNA stage BC, and show a 10 year time to Richter syndrome of 12%. 40% of patients were mutated without a complex karyotype or a TP53 other normalities. And for them, the 10 year time to Richter syndrome was only 3%. In this study, we identified variable, uh, variables associated with uh, a higher risk uh, of developing Richter syndrome transformation and recapitulated them into a Richter syndrome scoring system. Remarkably, patients harboring a CK subtype as, uh, at the CLL diagnosis have uh, the highest risk of developing Richter syndrome and should be carefully monitoring during the clinical follow-up.